We are eyeing up, I believe, that northern part of the Albuquerque metro and some port of Rio Rancho there from this uh, particular view from the crest. A higher afternoon storm chances kick in today. A weather impact evening for that reason. Uh, we are still going to go with the storm chance in play for the burning of Zozobra on Friday. It doesn't look as active as we originally thought, and we do have a dry trend coming early next week. Moisture feed still switched on, but this dry air is going to press in for our Thursday and shut down storm chances for a lot of us for, well, briefly on our Thursday afternoon afternoon today, though, uh, we're still drawing up the moisture from the south and there could be morning scattered showers in southwest New Mexico into that three, four and five o'clock hour increasing storms here into the state's midsection. Highs 70s and 80s for a lot of us. This is one of our cooler temperature days of the week. Hottest corner of the state will be southeast New Mexico. We're still above 90 and any chance that a storm only comes late in the day and never really gets that good for you around Roswell and Carlsbad and Clovis and Hobbs. Uh, but through central New Mexico and the western part of the state, storms do look likely. Uh, we've had downpours on our burn scars earlier this week. We flash flooded and I think uh, all of these locations at one time or another. So the mountains around Los Alamos points west to the Sangre de Cristos in Las Vegas, Rudos to the Sacramento Mountains. Flood watch again today from 11 until 9 this evening. Uh, generally watching storms wind down and weaken in most spots overnight with lows back in the 50s and 60s. Now here's that dry air push that I was talking about for Thursday. Uh, we aren't completely dry within our state's borders, but mainly just eyeing up a slight chance of storms on the mountains and over portions of eastern New Mexico. We do spike the temperatures a little bit, but only up to 88 in Albuquerque, low and mid 90s in southern New Mexico. Uh, then after Thursday's down day of storm coverage, storm coverage does increase a bit on Friday here through central and uh, portions of eastern New Mexico. You're still probably dry in the Four Corners area. Uh, got Santa Fe's high at 80 degrees on Friday before a chance at scattered showers and thunderstorms does kick in. Uh, we'll be dropping into the 70s and just watching for those hit and miss spots of showers and storms and uh, those occasional lightning flashes. Albuquerque seven day has that rain chance up at 50% today, then down at 10% tomorrow. Uh, back at 30% for Friday and 20 and 10 percenters for the weekend. Uh, we do trend drier uh, Sunday into Labor Day Monday. Uh, we'll take that storm chance out by Monday. Uh, let's talk about about seven day forecast for other corners of the state. Here's northwest New Mexico back in on a chance at rain today, but uh, it's just a one day deal with high temperatures in the 80s. We're dry tomorrow and probably dry Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Those are days where we can't rule out an isolated gusty thunder shower, but the chance doesn't look good. Uh, skies ripe for storms in southwest New Mexico. We are drying up after some overnight showers and storms, and the afternoon has them redeveloping. Only 79 today in Silver City and 80s off the mountains. Dry tomorrow, and then Friday, Saturday, Sunday, getting back in on that slight chance at storms with temperatures in the 80s and upper 70s. Here's southeast New Mexico go kind of on the edge of the best storm chance today. We do expect storms on the Sacramento's, but uh, that Fort Sumner down through Roswell and Carlsbad corridor over towards Hobbs. Rain chances are low and late in the day. A little better chance tomorrow. Friday does look more active with a drop into the 80s. Uh, that'll go down as our first 80 degree high temperature since early in July, almost two full months. Northeast New Mexico, I would expect some scattered showers and thunderstorms for the later afternoon and evening hours, and we are concerned about heavy rainfall and those burn scars up around the Las Vegas area. Uh, a less active Thursday than a more active Friday, and then into Saturday and Sunday, uh, storm chances really do drop off and we'll have comfortable 70s on the thermometer. And here's north central New Mexico. Here's around Santa Fe, upper 70s to about 80 degrees for our afternoon highs. We do expect scattered showers and thunderstorms and yeah, those wildfire burn scars just west of Los Alamos. They flash flooded yesterday. They could again today. Uh, we're generally quiet for our Thursday so a chance at scattered storms is back in play for Friday's burning of Zozobra and still around Saturday and then really dropping off for Sunday and for Monday.